So what's up? So we were talking about the tone of the show and how it's very family friendly and very light. But uh, I mean, Doctor Who is also like that in its whimsical sense. But then there's also episodes that are profoundly, not really disturbing, but but chilling in in that uh, they, they take those nursery rhymes and they're creepy as in itself. Yeah. Is there any of that in the show? Yeah, we try to. It, it, all light doesn't work. Yeah. You know, it, it, usually the balance for the show is if the personal story is a little lighter, the story itself is a little darker. Mm -hmm. But we did um, one of the episodes in the middle, um, uh, The Librarians of the Dark Heart, and I love we get to do the whole title like the pulps. We actually fought for that, <laughs> and they actually let us do it. And that was Doc Savage in the Temple of Gold, The Librarians, and it's, it's oh, such a great cool. tradition. Um, there, we do a straight up haunted house episode. Okay. And and the writer said, I just want to do a haunted house. Like, let's just do a straight up horror episode. Cool. And it's genuinely creepy and it's genuinely disturbing. And the villain is really awful. Uh, and, and it comes from like a real story we found doing research. Like, oh, that's really kind of screwed up. Let's, let's do that. So I don't think just because of the nature of the show, the first season, we will ever get quite as dark as some of the darker episodes have been. But definitely, we try to find the disturbing elements of certain of them. And then some of them are just giant light comedy rocks. 